Okay, this is question three on the Algebra 2 EOC practice test. It says, which expression is equivalent to cosine of 150 degrees? Well, the first thing we need to look at is we just kind of need to get an idea of what the unit circle looks like. So, if you can remember, you just do a sketch of it and pay no attention to my wonderful artwork here. But we know that each of these is a 90 degree increment. So, we know this is 0 or 360. And if it's 150 degrees, the positives go around that way. And just for future reference, negatives go that way. So we're looking at that, and it says 150 degrees. So we've got to start thinking, where is 150? Well, we know it would be between 90 and 180. So we know it's somewhere in there. Well, 90 and 180, that's 90 degrees. So that's not going to help us much to try to split it. So we start thinking, you know, remember from your classes that each of these little marks, that first one, second, and then a third one in there, this would be 30, this is 45, and 60. Well, luckily, they're the same increments on the other side. So when we add, well, if that's 90, well, another 30 is 120. And, and this is 135 and so this mark here is 150 well so that's there is our 150 degrees so we need to find out which one is equivalent to that so the equivalent angles would be going around the negative way so we just go back up and match well it would still have to be there but what is it going the negative route well, what would total 360? So we do the math and we subtract 150 from that and what do we get? 210. So we pick up there and we see 210 and we know that it's a negative route so it has to be cosine of negative 210 degrees. And that would be one of the best ways to do that. Good luck.